The original NES had a buttload of peripherals to go with it, and quality varied with each one. For every power pad or NES advantage, there was a power glove or a rolling rocker. Arguably, the Zapper was the most popular and well-known of these. While the accessories for the Super NES weren't as numerous or flashy as its predecessors, one of the better known ones was the Super Scope. Unlike the Zapper, which needed to be plugged into the console, the Super Scope was wireless, powered by six AA batteries. The method for registering input also differed. Unlike traditional light gun games, an infrared sensor had to be connected to the system and placed on top of the TV to pick up your fired shots. Despite the cool marketing, the Super Scope was a commercial dud and was discontinued by the mid-90s. But not before giving us the only Mario first person shooter to date. This is Yoshi Safari. Bowser has taken over not the Mushroom Kingdom, but Jewelry Land. Never heard of it? Not shot. King Fred and Prince Pine are captured, and their country has literally been ripped apart. The twelve magic gems that stabilized Jewelry Land were dispersed among the Koopa King's henchmen. Their separation broke the country into dark and light realms. Only through the magic of firepower can Mario save the day. As you probably expect, the levels are on rails. You shoot an assortment of enemies, mostly aerial based ones, as they come at you. Do not shoot Yoshi or you will be penalized by a decrease in health. You can also lose health by falling off the track or going through water. Well, except for that one stage where you are underwater. But seriously, learn how to jump in the game. Usually, when you're partway through a stage, you'll find a mini boss. This role is typically filled by a Hammer Brother variant, though not always. When beaten, you can shoot down an item box containing a power up for when you fight the boss. Speaking of bosses, the ones at the end of the Light Realm stages are the Koopalings. Except for Wendy. When you defeat a boss, you recover one of the gems. Once all seven Koopalings are beaten, King Fred is saved, and you advance to the Dark Realm to find Fred's Pine. Dark Realm has four stages to start off with, but no Mecha Vows at the end of the game. Well, okay, one. Dark Realm is also home to the most annoying stage in the whole game, Ghost Mansion. The main parts aren't anything to write home about, but the fight with the spiny spamming Lakitu is so great for me because you're focused on shooting him down while his little friends creep up on you. They come so fast and you need to take them out, but Yoshi's head's in the way and, again, shooting him leads to a health deduction. Jump over. I've been doing it the hard way for so many years, and this method works. The boss is only slightly better. This big boo sends the brief flying at you like Darth Vader in the Empire Strikes Back. But once you shoot him up enough, uh-oh, he breaks up into three smaller boos that shuffle around. The one sticking his tongue out is the one that needs to be shot. Honestly, those two fights could use just a little more polish. With 11 gems in tow, you can go after Bowser. In the last stage, you go through a gauntlet of every other mini-boss in the game. This is followed up by Powered Armor Bowser. Make sure that Bowser never fires that wave motion gun in his chest. It will hurt. When he sheds his suit, Take out the claws and send some nice, refreshing turbo shots down his throat. Despite successfully saving Prince Pine and restoring Jewelry Land, the efforts of Mario and Yoshi would ultimately be for nothing. For you see, Jewelry Land goes the way of Mario Land. Faded from all memory and almost never referenced. 
a shame really. I found this to be a pretty enjoyable game, all things considered. The music is handled splendidly, and the game does a masterful job with the Mode 7 graphics. The concept of Mario packing heat might sound weird, but I say check it out. You'll be surprised. Warning, warning, Mary Ray Lapsing. Warning, warning, Mary Ray Lapsing. Huh, warning, Ray. warning. Frankie Kong's kicks one off. Warning. Uh, hold warning. on, everyone. We'll Mary get this train down in just a minute. Warning. Take it away, Yoshi.